Hey everyone, it's Mike from Battle Archives, and today we are looking at one of our most popular maps from D-Day. One of the best maps created during the amphibious landings at Normandy, this map shows the initial troop movements up until midnight of 6 June going into the 7th. Both Allied and Axis units are annotated on this map. Units shown are the 101st Airborne, note the AB near the town of Carentan, the 4th Infantry Division, which hit the westernmost beach, also known as Utah Beach, and to the east at Omaha, we can see the regiments of the 29th Infantry Division, the 115th, 116th, and the 16th. Further to the east, there are the British at Sword and Gold Beaches, along with their airborne and glider units, with the Canadians at Juneau Beach are annotated here as well. Another piece of interesting history about this map is that it came from Headquarters, 1st United States Army Group, which was the paper command set up with George Patton in command in Dover to deceive the Axis powers the invasion was coming across at the narrowest point of the English Channel and landing at the Pas de Calais. 